फ्रेंड्स लेट्स डिस्कस क्वेश्चन नंबर 83 दिस क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम डायग्रामेटिक पजल सो दिस क्वेश्चन स्टेट्स इन द फॉलोइंग फिगर नंबर ऑफ ट्रायंगल्स आर रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय कैपिटल टी स्क्वायर्स आर रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय कैपिटल एस एंड द नंबर ऑफ सर्कल्स आर रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय कैपिटल सी एंड व्हाट वी हैव टू फाइंड इन दिस क्वेश्चन द वैल्यू ऑफ दिस गिवन एक्सप्रेशन सो फर्स्ट लेट्स काउंट द नंबर ऑफ ट्रायंगल्स सो हाउ वी कैन काउंट द नंबर ऑफ ट्रायंगल्स इन द गिवन फिगर so you can see that here we have a square like structure and in this structure diagonals are joined as well as you can also see that the midpoints of the opposite sides are also joined that means we are getting a square like this in which diagonals are joined the midpoints are joined so in this structure we have total number of triangles as 16 so you can see that we have total 16 number of triangles in the given figure now let's count the number of squares so you can see that if you take this outermost square so this in this square you can see that the midpoints are joined so again we are getting the four squares including this outer one we are we have total five square in the outermost structure so when we consider the inner square again we can see that the midpoints are joined we again obtain five squares so you can write here the number of squares in the given figure is equal to 10 Now friends let's count the number of circles which is very easy so you can simply count the number of circles here we have 3 3 3 3 that means we are getting 12 circles if you consider the inner most and this largest circle we have total number of 14 circles in the given figure so you can write here the number of circles is 14 so after finding the number of triangles number of squares and number of circles we can find the value of the given expression t plus s minus c whole square that means 16 plus 10 26 26 minus 14 we are obtaining 12 that means we have to find the 12 square so the correct answer for this question is option number 2 so you can write here the answer for this question is option number 2 so i hope you understood this question based on the concepts of diagrammatic puzzle now let's move forward to the next question now friends let's solve question number 84 So here in this question we have to find the correct missing number that means we have to find the number which will replace this question mark now come to the solution so first we'll find the pattern in the given figure you can see that here this number in the circle is 34 which is the sum of the squares of these two numbers so if right here 3 square plus 5 square what we are obtaining 34 clear further this number 61 in this circle is obtained by the sum of the squares of these two numbers so it can be written as 6 square 36 plus 5 square that means 25 and further you can see that 100 is obtained by 8 square plus 6 square clear so we'll apply the same pattern in this group of numbers so here we have 113 in the circle so it can be written as 113 is equal to 7 square plus this question mark square so which number will replace this question mark definitely 8 so 8 is the correct answer and you can write here the option number 3 is the correct answer for this question so i hope you understood this question now let's move forward to the next question now friends let's solve question number 85 this question states choose the correct option to complete the given figure x now come to the solution so here we can see that we have to fill this question mark by one of the given option figure which will satisfy the given pattern in the figure so here we can join this square and this sector shaded sector clear now then you can join this line like this and then after shade it outside this clear and then we have another so you can see that here the fourth option is the correct answer for this question because we are getting the same structure so you can mark here the option number 4 is correct here so the answer for this question is option number 4 i hope you understood this question now let's move forward to the next question now friends let's discuss question number 86 this question states choose the odd one out from the given figures so you can see that in all the figures we have the alternate segments are shaded except in figure number 2 so you can see that here the correct answer for this question is option number 2 the answer will be option number 2 so i hope you understood this question now let's move forward to the next question